Hi, I'm making this video about how to get into FPV. If you want to fly drones FPV, I'm going to show you the best ways, the cheapest, easiest way to do it in 2024. Um, it's a lot easier now than it used to be because a lot of different companies are getting behind it and helping people do it. One of the easiest ways, I would say, is this right here, the DJI FPV or Avada. This comes with everything you need, the remote, battery, drone, ready to go. It has GPS. It's very beginner friendly. You can take off. You can take off in GPS, fly it up to get high away from you, then shut the GPS off, put it in manual mode, and then you're full FPV. And then if you get scared, flip it back in to take over in GPS so you don't crash it. But the, draw, the big drawback is that it once it's crashed, you have to pay $100, $200 and send it in to DJI to fix it. So that's the easiest way to get into FPV. Now I'm going to show you the cheapest way. Well, I got some help on this one. They're going to show you the cheapest way to get into FPV. So this one is, do you want to show them? Show them the, this one is Beta FPV. How would you describe this one? I would describe it by fun, easy, and a lot of other stuff. Yeah, and it holds up when you crash it? Yep. Pretty strong. Mm -hmm. What does it come with? It comes with the batteries, remote, and goggles. Yep, comes with. But we all agree, I'm the best at it, especially when I'm wearing the goggles. Yep. He's very good at flying in the house with the goggles. Uh -huh. Some people can do it better than others. Better than me. He's, he's better than me. Yes, it, it was probably $200, $250. Comes with the drone, remote, goggles, batteries, charger, everything you need. And if you like, here's a closer look at the front and the back. Yep, it's got, you can always replace the motors. There's even a camera in it. Yep, it's got a camera for the, for the goggles. For the goggles. And it's... Got different... And a very nice remote. We have the home button, the up button, the sideways button so you can mm -hmm. turn. This is, I, I'm not actually sure what this it's is. It's got different levels. And um, this is so you can turn it on. So turn if the I went motors. Like, that's how you would turn it on. I don't know what this does, I don't know what this does, and I don't know what this does. <laughs> and he's doing that with goggles. It has different... This um, is hard to see! You can have it so it's not full manual mode. It will just have like more of a hover mode and three different levels and then you can go full manual mode and fly it outside. It, um, it will handle a little bit of wind but not a ton. Um, I mean I flew it in pretty windy and it still will fly but you don't get very far. And then you can also do a true FPV. Um, that is with more of a drone like this. Um, this is the Fly, Flywoo Explorer. Um, you can buy this as a bind and fly, or you can build it. I bought it bind and fly. I didn't want to build it. Um, with this, you have to buy goggles, a remote, batteries, a charger, this can add up to just as much as the one from DJI, but this is much easier to fix. If you crash it, you can replace the parts and fix it yourself, but it also is a little harder because you have to use Betaflight Configurator and figure all that out. Um, I started with the DJI FPV because it was the easiest to do. But it's also, if you crash it, you can't fix it easy yourself. And so then I bought this to practice on and now bought this 
to learn how to fly better with. This is more of a cruiser, but you can still do manual mode with this. You'll still learn how to fly. Um, and you, with this, you have to buy your own battery, your own charger. So there are more expensive ways to do it with that. I mean, not more expensive ways. It's just, it can become more expensive depending on what you buy. And this, like I have between this, the goggles, I'm at probably $1,100. It's just as much if more than the FPV, the beta, or the, I'm sorry, more than the DJI FPV. But it's also easier to fix. So those are a couple ways that you can get into FPV. So with flying this type, it's probably a lot hard, fun. Yeah, you might have more fun, but it's also harder. There's no GPS. It won't. <laughs> it won't hover for you in place. You have to fly it. And what else do we got? We also got some pictures. Max, I painted this for like 10 minutes. Max, let's show you. I mean, so I'm going to show his. Okay, you show. And mine is called the Ocean Shell. That's what I call it. Mine is called A Day Has Passed, A War Has Begun. Like and subscribe. There's also like another... and subscribe to see more see, to see more videos like this, bro. Yeah. There's also <laughs> one of just me dancing. What 